Welcome to Tykes TV. Uh, got two young men on here. Uh, we all love Barnsley, so I've got Caelan. We've seen Caelan before. Hiya, Caelan. And we've got a new guest on, uh, Ertz. So, Ertz, it's a pleasure to have you on, mate. Oh, thank you. Not a problem. Uh, so, right, Caelan, I'll come to you first, and then we'll it'll be nice and easy for Ertz. Um, what a win back, what a weekend. 4-1 against uh, Derby. A few goals here. What, what were you taking it? A deserved win? Well, Norwood, he was putting pressure on defenders non-stop. Um, so he had a good goal, good football. We didn't give up. When they scored, it was... We were still winning, but they'd, usually then they'd give up. But we kept pushing. We didn't stop. That's what it's all about, isn't it? I mean, we, I think right from uh, this minute to last, I mean, it's coming to you, mate. I mean, four goals against Derby were up there, you know, in, in, in top of position. But pleasing to see for me, I don't know what your take on is, but uh, Luke Thomas coming back from injury and, and getting a last minute goal, what, what were your take on game, uh, uh, I think um, they were pressing a bit and like they were passing a lot and crowd got behind them a lot, so that's how they won. Yeah, I mean, do, do you agree with that as well? Eh? It's is that I think Norwood and like Cole were doing a lot of pressing and like putting their goalkeeper under pressure and all, which yeah. like led to goal as well. Yeah, yeah, Caelan, I mean. You obviously went to earn your birthday and you can see match one shirt behind you. Uh, Norwood, which is also Ertz's favourite player. Uh, just been talking off air about him. Again, Norwood, is, although he's a, an older player, is helping other players out, uh, around him, do you, do you think? Well, he is probably... Like, he's getting behind them. I can see that. He likes helping, I mean... He looks like he's like helping the coach, but he can get behind the boys. He is a good player and he never gives up, really. Never gives up, yeah. I mean, eh, it's his, is Norwood a player? I know he's your, uh, you, you know, you've just been on about it off air, but Norwood's is uh, your favourite player. Do you think he's helping younger players out at clubs, such as like Luke O'Connell and Devante Cole, who, Struggling for him. Do you think he's helping them kind of players around him to get the best out of them? I think he's trying to get best out of them. All players around him. Like helping them bring him into the game and yeah. score goals, obviously. Yeah. I mean, Caelan, just, just going to you, I mean, oh, we are man at match because I, I've Find it pretty hard for me to pick a, a man at match what game. Uh, I know Herbie came while getting mentioned and Jordan Williams and Ishted in goal. But was there an actual player that stood out for you? For me, I get it more or less for team because I thought every every player played a part. Well, we did. Everybody put the effort in there, tried, the, tried their best. I could see that, especially the fans, they tried to get behind mm. them. But what. Mm, one of the match, I think, could be go to Luke Thomas. Thomas, we coming back from injury and getting a goal. Yeah. In front of Ponty end, I mean, hey, it's coming to you, mate. Uh, like I say, a lot of players all playing well, uh, form, scoring goals. <coughs> We've only lost two games since November, I believe. So, again, coming up with fixtures, what are coming up, it's we need to carry that form on coming into games, uh, don't we? Yeah. I think man at match uh, was cool. I think he did well pressing and passing and helping yeah. team up. No, no, can I mate? Yeah, yeah, go on, yeah. I mean, for me, we call, like you said, via pressing and passing and also scored two goals as well, didn't he? Yeah. Do you think that'll help him? Do you think that'll help call out with a bit of confidence as well? Because he'd, he hadn't scored for a, a, a couple of games. Uh, it's not for you know lack of effort, but I think a couple of goals might help him with confidence with games coming up. 
Yeah. I mean, we want to Bristol Rovers, uh, Caleb. Again, we bet him at Oakwell uh, a few months back, well, before Christmas, wasn't it, really? How do you see this going at Bristol Rovers and Caleb? Do you think it's going to be a bounce of win? Do you think there'll be many goals in it? Well, I think it's got to be a bounce of win. It's not going to be an easy match mid table, mm. but I think it should be a bounce of win 2 0 away. 2 0, yeah. Or do you so think Caleb will be the most important player for us on the day, do you think? Well, they've all put the effort in last match, so I hope that they do that again. But main player it was probably the main player last time, but I think he's going to put the effort in again, James Norwood. Probably. Norwood, you, you're going for Norwood, you'll think of it, right? Yeah, good, good shout, mate, good shout. Uh, it's coming to you. I mean, just like what Caelan was saying via, put effort in, quick start, back pressing like you, you touched on earlier, there. It's, how do you see this going? Uh, do you think it's going to be a balance win? Do you think there'll be many goals in it? And who do you think will be the most important player for you? I think um, Barnsley will win uh, 3 0. 3 0. Mm. Yeah, and I think most important player will probably be um, Cole. Cole? Yeah, you're going for Cole again. Probably carrying on that confidence and hoping he can carry it on. So, yeah, good shout. Um, I'm going to say. I'd like it to be a clean sheet. I know you've said three no eights and uh Caelan said two. I'm going two one. Uh I just think there's probably a goal in it. You know what Joey Barton's like with, with his team about the set pieces. Um but I'm hoping like what your boss said via is that we set off quick, fast, high tempo and press. For me, hmm, my key player. I think I might go for Luca Connell. Uh, in midfield, I think if he can get ball and, and help out and create chances for such as like Norwood, what you've said, Caleb, and uh, Devante Cole, what you've said, Ertz. So I'm going 2 1 Barnes the win, and I'm going Luca Connell. Um, and again, it's going to be a, a tough game, but Caleb, do you think that players are, have got confidence behind them right now? Can we take that into him? Well, we've been talking about Norwood putting confidence on him. I think they'll come into the game with confidence, like it seemed like they did last match. Mm. So, uh, so carry it on. And I think really we should carry on more defensive. So then we're holding on to where we are, our place, where we are in the league. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fair point, Matt. Yeah, going to your I mean, we've said scores. Uh, we're all we're all going for a bounce win, which is great. Uh, do you think that we can like keep his confidence going, keep the momentum going into the next game? Uh, yeah, it's just effort players put in. If they put hundred percent effort or more, the, I think the confidence will go. Yeah, uh, both good shouts. Uh, we entered the midweek game this week, so we've had like a, a bit of rest from Derby game, so we should be going into this pretty fresh. And we'll be going into Portsmouth uh, next Tuesday, so fixtures thick and fast. Um, Eps, fantastic having you on, mate. You've done really well. I've been pleased with you. Uh, I hope you, you come on again yeah. soon. Uh, yeah. Caelan, always a pleasure talking to you, mate, and I might see you at Mount uh, when you when you go. Uh, see you at Ponty End. I know you're both uh, in real life, so I might both. Uh, see you both in there but uh, Ertz and Caleb appreciate you having you on uh, people what's watching please like subscribe and share let us know your score predictions let us know your thoughts um, one thing left to say you Reds <laughs>